bit. So today we are having a lot to do. Like the yeah. kiddos are picking what they want to make for dinner and they're helping us. They picked and we let two them meals. Pick whatever they wanted and they couldn't agree. So they picked two meals. So I'm making shrimp Alfredo, which I feel like you had a say in that. I wasn't even downstairs. I said, guys, Drew those shrimp you guys Alfredo. Pick. And I walked away so they could be independent and pick themselves. Yeah. They picked their own drinks. Mm -hmm. They got root beer and Fanta, which you were like, who got Fanta? Your kids, that's who. And and then we are, what else are we supposed to be doing? Setting up the soda bar, so yeah. Gina has, actually we have family coming over tomorrow for game night, and we're gonna make a soda bar and try it out with them. So we get to make all kinds of crazy concoctions with the soda bar. So are we gonna do s'mores as well? I feel like we should do s'mores. Yeah, why not? Let's do it. Yay, yay. So we'll do s'mores and then what else do you wanna do? I think it's a well, lot. I think we're just going to end the night with a movie. Wait, what kind of movie? I don't know. I haven't even picked one yet. Okay. A movie. That's a lot. <laughs> and it's... It's 6 p.m. I told you it was a lot to do today. I said, are you sure you want to do all this? You said, yeah, let's do it. Why yeah, not? I, maybe I did. <laughs> well, let me finish these dishes and then we'll start. I'll start on dinner. I'll have to start on two dinners. Okay. Sounds good. Mmm. Panda and Tiger. They're gonna actually help us make dinner. Mm -hmm. I got the frying pan. Um, and so yeah, we're gonna get all the ingredients out and we are gonna start probably browning the meat, right? Mm -hmm. And we gotta get the shrimp out and the sauces. So just start with browning the meat, please. Okay. And we'll brown the meat first. I put this. I'll do the meat cutting table. That was the one to put that down. I'm doing something crazy. We have family coming over tomorrow for game night and I thought it would be so cool to do a dirty soda bar. And so Tiger and Panda are helping me set it up. So we just, let me just show you. So we have syrups. I have a couple more sugar-free syrups. So I got a drink mate and set up a soda stream only because I heard a lot of great things and it's not. Um, you didn't get a soda stream? No, I didn't. Because the, someone said the drink mate is better, so okay. I got this instead. So we're going to make like club soda and this, and they have like this, and they have like the CO2 machine. I've never used anything like this, but I do know how to make dirty sodas. So we're going to practice. We're gonna make some. What do you think? Wait, we're gonna make Which some one are you gonna soda? make first? We're gonna make the club soda. Club soda. We're club just, soda first. Yeah. So just like it's just we need to put water in this, and we need to put. So do you? Some water? you want, Put it in here or what? Yeah, so they need to put oh, water yeah. and fill it up to that line where you see the line. Wait. And then we need to leave it in the fridge. Yeah. Okay. Why do you leave it in the fridge? Because it needs to be cold water. Can you add ice to your soda? Huh? Can you add ice to your soda? Yes. No. But you need it to be cold. This needs to be cold water, please. And then uh, we're gonna read the instructions and hopefully, maybe with dinner we can like have like a little bit, like a little mini one. I don't know. I'm just hoping that we don't. Oh, our mini kid cups. We can, everybody can have. That needs to go in the fridge. Oh right. Sorry. I forgot. He's like so interested, like in this. He's like, oh, I gotta let you know. <laughs> um, we'll see. I don't know. I'm just worried about ruining this. You have to look at these instructions, Drew. Okay, I will. I don't know how to put the CO2 stuff. I don't know how. And I don't want to blow up. Roof is a fuser. Yeah, how would you blow up? Yeah, that's Wait, what stop. What? You sure you're supposed to do that? Yeah. You sure? Yep. Where'd you see the instructions to say that? Step one, remove plastic. That's not the right one. This isn't the right one? True. Okay, you're right. That's the back right there. Step one, remove black cover. How are you gonna get to the CO2 if you don't remove the black cover? See? Okay. No explosions. Yet. Trash, please. Oh my goodness. 
Insert threaded part into the unit receptacle and hand tighten. Replace back the cover. So easy peasy. And tighten. Okay, don't try to tighten. Cover. Be gentle. This is dangerous. <gasps> see, see, this is when you try try to extra to be extra, and you not. You. If we wanted to make like orange soda, we could fill it with cold water, some syrup, and then fizz it up. So we'll practice tonight, and we'll make some with the kiddos before our family comes over tomorrow. Yeah, I guess so. It'll be fun. It'll be okay. I think we'll find. Like, I think we have some straws. I have some a bunch of toppings for tomorrow, so not for today. A bunch of toppings. Stop doing that. You break it, you're buying me a whole new one. Then I buy this one to be. No. <laughs> so we got some syrup, some straws. I got a bunch of toppings, cherries, lemons, limes, and oranges. And then um, we have this, we have whipped cream, half and half. And then I got some sodas as well. So it, it's, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be a fun night. I'm just hoping people like this. So dinner is going really good. I have just been watching the little baby. He is so fussy, a little bit sick. Gina is doing a fabulous job with dinner. Oh, Gordon Ramsay would be proud. No, he wouldn't. He'd complain about this. <laughs> Tell the truth. What do you think he'd complain about? All of this. No, he would not. Yes, he would. He may complain that it's taken a long time, but once he tasted it, <laughs> oh, is that what you're boom, trying to tell me? he'd be blown away. That looks good. What 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 kind of flavors you got in that sauce, ma'am? Tell me a little bit about you're, your dish. You are bugging me. Okay, well, it's a shrimp alfredo. The shrimp alfredo sauce. I'll probably put a little bit of lime, and boom, we're good. Why are you making it? It's just spaghetti and meat sauce and shrimp alfredo, y'all. It's interesting. It's interesting to you because we know you're about to eat some. The kiddos have got the table set. We've been trying so hard to use less cups and do less dishes. <laughs> so I have the kids using their water bottles for dinner tonight. Do any of you guys do that? Like, just get tired of doing all the dishes and so you start finding like hacks to get around how many dishes your kids produce. We've tried assigning cups, and the kids just get new cups. So we're gonna try water bottles for a little while. ever made s'mores on a grill me neither so here's the grill and we're gonna make some s'mores good old internet told me just put on the heat on high throw a graham cracker on there throw a marshmallow on there well graham cracker chocolate on one rack roast the marshmallow and then put them together and you have wonderful wonderful s'mores you guys ready to make s'mores on the grill yeah I'm helping I'm helping you're gonna help s'mores. yeah you can help me cook the s'mores it'll be perfect all right, sweetie, you want to bring me the graham crackers and the chocolate and the marshmallows? All right, stand back. I'm going to go ahead and light it. So what they said online, what we have to do, we have to put the graham crackers here on the top row and the chocolate on top of that. And then we need to put this marshmallow on a skewer and you're gonna roast it like you would over a campfire. So all the marshmallows have to be on skewers. Y'all gonna go put them on skewers? Yeah. Okay. I don't know how uh, quick these are supposed to cook so it's kind of an experiment for us. But that sure is hot. I feel like this is a redneck campfire right here. There's his roasting. Once it starts to roast, kind of rotate it a little bit. Yep, keep it over there. I'm still not roasting here. Uh, Mama, can you grab me a spatula? Okay, I want that. After 
this get our tire tasting little my marshmallow Okay, Wait, where's mine? Yours is right here, I believe. These ones are going to cook. I don't know. We're going to see. All right, go out in the yard to eat it. You guys, look at this. Nuts. Oh my goodness. Chocolate is what's exciting. Okay, you're going to eat it. Open, shut them. Open. <laughs> I know you just have chocolate everywhere. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep. You guys, that was super deceptive. That chocolate looked like it wasn't even melted. We took it off and it's like everywhere. I'm about to fall off. I ate like. I love it. This tastes a little better than this one we usually make. We had a little bit of a debacle. We just had a little issue. As we're cooking the marshmallows on the grill, I like turn away for a second and then Panda starts screaming, what do I do, what do I do? He panics, he moves the marshmallow out of the grill and onto the cardboard box. So I look over and kind of up and I see a flaming marshmallow on a cardboard box. Start this huge fire and burn our house down. And that's about it. I think it's delicious. Better than normal? Yeah. Like better than over a campfire? Yeah. Yes. Really? Better yeah. than over a campfire? Yeah. Two thumbs up. I think she's trying to be silly. So, second marshmallow, first one burnt down to the ground. How is it? Medium. Medium. I'd say campfire is better. Oh, you like the campfire because better? Because with the <gasps> grill, you can't even see it changing. It looked the same, didn't it? But uh -huh. it was melted on the inside. We have the projector behind me, and we're just getting the Wi-Fi set up. Uh, we have a Roku in the back, and we are getting ready to pick a movie. It is already so late, guys. This probably will turn into a sleepover. I would not be surprised if each of the kids wake up here in the morning, which is okay. Like, we like to do fun stuff like this. So you can see the kiddos moving on in. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Yep. Then the gummies. Do you know what um, show you want to watch or movie? Oh, um, I would love to watch Baymax if it's out. We got one for Baymax. Bad guys. Bad guys. Bad guys. Two, three. Bad guys. Oh. Well, it sounds like we're going to be watching Bad Guys. I no, we need to watch Bad Guys and Baymax. And the one that we did was we did and knock out your eggs. One of your eggs get ready to eat. Knock, 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 and make that for his eggs. That's a super. We may have took too much on. Maybe. <laughs> Probably. What time is it? It's, it's okay. late. It's oh like 9.30. But we got the pallets out, the kids got the sleeping bags so they can fall asleep when they want and technically have a sleepover. Aww. And uh, they decided to watch Bad Guys. I know you just got Penguin to sleep. I know, Poor. he just didn't want to go to sleep. He was I heard just him crying. Yeah. No. But we, I mean, it's fun. It's just sometimes you don't realize what you're getting into until you start to do it. But we ended up uh, not testing the, the soda bar. So we'll do that tomorrow. Yeah, we'll definitely do it. We'll, we'll have to do it tomorrow. tomorrow. Yeah. Um, and so we'll test the soda bar tomorrow. But we had a fun day. The kids really had fun. That's the most important part, that they mm -hmm. had fun. I'm just glad that you guys are here with us. And uh, I'm going to go to sleep. I'm exhausted. Bye, guys. <laughs> Bye.